everybody, it's Tim with Engadget. We're taking a look at the new iBook Store textbooks, which have just been introduced and just been announced. We've got a selection of them here in uh, the book selection on this iPad that we're using. We're going to start with the E.O. Wilson uh, Life on Earth book, which is one of the bigger ones that they were talking about today. And in fact, it's one of the more impressive looking books that uh, is on demo for the day. As you can see, we've got a pretty traditional interface. You can swipe back and forth to begin with. You can pinch on any of these things and bring them up full screen. And many of them are interactive. You can see I can tab down here to get different graphics from this presentation. And if I want to go back, I can just pinch it away. Down here there's a video. I can tap that and it brings up the video to play over. Some videos will actually play in place without coming up. Here's another video. This is kind of the centerpiece of this new textbook effort that Apple is putting forward, and we think it's a very impressive one, to be sure. Here, for example, you can tap on different parts of the insect's body, and in these different types of insects, it shows you those different parts highlighted. Again, very impressive. Now, obviously, creating these widgets is going to be uh, a bit uh, of a challenge for just a straight publisher, but this is something that Apple is making easier with the creation of uh, the new software tool that they're releasing today online for the creation of these things, and you can publish them for free, which is fantastic. So again, we're looking at some uh, demonstrations here. E.O. Wilson showing the pheromone trail. And this is just one of the many books we've got on access. Let's jump out of here. We can see we've got a view of the different chapters. But there are a lot of different books we can take a look at. We'll go back to the library. Which takes just a moment. Let's go to something a little bit more boring, perhaps, like uh, Chemistry from McGraw-Hill. This is an example of a very common textbook used in high schools across the country. And there are many of these books that are going to be there at launch. And you can see things are maybe a little bit less flashy here, but still you get a lot of graphics, a lot of charts, a lot of data. And you can still pinch on these things to bring them up full screen and interact with them, which is great. And of course, all this content will be updated in real time as updates happen. Finally, let's show you the note. If you do a long tap and drag, it gives you this highlight section. So it'll highlight that, and these notes will be tracked so you can look them up later. You can also tap on here, change the color if you want to, so you can have different color highlights for different topics. You can then type in your own notes. And again, that note will be archived, so you can pull them all up in one shot uh, a little later. And there you go. There's the note that I just created with the highlighted text plus my own note. You can pull these together. You can make study charts. You can make uh, through thought cards just by tapping here. And there we go. You see, I can look through these, and uh, it's, it's, it's a great way to learn. It looks like it's going to be very interactive and uh, an exciting new change for textbooks. So this is our first hands-on with one of the new textbooks in iBooks from Apple.